Okay, so I've been planning to film a, a lookbook video. The reason I haven't had many videos up this week is because um, I got really ill. Yesterday I had this full-blown cold or flu or something, so um, yeah, I've just been feeling a bit groggy. Hey Fruit Bats, it's Freely Banana Girl here. Welcome to another episode and we have... Durunata, back from Venezuela. Great. So today's video is on Beauty Crush. I just wanted to make this video because... Oh, I'm just disgusted. Like this video that she made has recipes in it which are just full of death, full of cruelty and basically just disgusting, full of fat and not healthy and should not be recommended to her viewers. So let's get into it. So these recipes are in particular packed with eggs, full of saturated animal fat, cholesterol, animal hormones, bacteria, uric acid. It's totally gross. And when you think about it, you are eating a chicken's period. So then I'm going to make my scrambled eggs. I'm going to take I think I took actually three eggs, but two yolks. Um, whisk that up. Half a billion eggs have been recalled on fears of salmonella infection. Food and Drug Administration officials say the outbreak has sickened more than a thousand people and the toll of illnesses is expected to go even higher. So just pour in your eggs and have it on a lower heat. As I noted last year, the Harvard Nurses Health Study found that the daily consumption of the amount of cholesterol found in just a single egg appeared to cut a woman's life short as much as smoking 25,000 cigarettes, uh, five cigarettes a day for 15 years. And that's just a single egg. That's not two or three eggs like Beauty Crush has used in this recipe for one meal. I mean, are eggs the new cigarette? And this study does seem to show that there are some major negative effects on atherosclerosis. Now, the important part of this is that atherosclerosis is a major risk determiner in strokes and heart disease. And it's not even, the study doesn't even look at people who eat lots of eggs, but it's just three, four eggs a week. Um, and that's pretty much it. When you're happy with it, just serve it on a plate. So the finished product is just basically a plate of fat. And then she goes on to add avocado and olive oil. So no wonder Samantha has those dark circles bags under her eyes because her adrenal glands from all that fat are going to be shot. Her kidneys are going to be overtaxed and her bowels are going to be backed up because there's a lack of fiber in her diet. And this, this animal protein and fat is just going to be clogging her up big time. Mm, so good. Hands not that not bad for you. Hands not that not bad for you. And guess what? We got more fat. We got chorizo, processed sausage, meat, and we've got olive oil, and then we've got some eggs, and we've got some feta cheese. So the World Health Organization recently came out confirming that processed meats do cause cancer. So you saw Samantha hoeing into that chorizo. That is not food, okay? This is not something that should be in your body, and it does increase the risk of cancer dramatically and a whole host of other diseases. So reports say just 50 grams, 50 grams of processed meat a day, less than two slices of bacon, increase the chances of developing colorectal cancer by 18% and a whole other host of cancers. So the classification of red and processed meats here you see salami, bacon, sausages, hot dogs are up the top. They are up the top. So leave that crap out of your diet and help yourself, help the animals and help the planet. So the real question for me here is, is Samantha trying to kill her viewers? So thumbs up if you want to see Samantha go fruit herself and jump on a high carb vegan raw to four lifestyle. She really needs to get more fruit into those bowels and into that face. So she just gets that healthy glow that she really can have. And Samantha, you're just going to feel so much better on this lifestyle. And you're going to do a great thing for not only your health, but the animals and the planet.